I mean, I think most people look at this and even the Sanders campaign might say, look, in terms of the delegate count, that may not be what the battle is about anymore for this Sanders campaign. It feels increasingly like this is about steering the Democratic Party to the left. This is about holding Joe Biden accountable in the most public okay. forum possible. Well, that's where we were at the same point in the last in the last presidential election. Where yeah. It wasn't numerically possible for Bernie to, you know, be the nominee, but he stayed in because, you know, he wanted to give his supporters an anchor on the issues and the message that Joe Biden sent, the message that, that supporters of his like me are sending is that you can count on Joe Biden and yeah, as our Democratic nominee to champion the issues that matter to you. He's been saying that this entire time, and yet that contingent, 18 to 29 year olds, young people, Bernie Sanders, right. overwhelmingly is winning them. And the question is, is there anything Joe Biden can say that is actually going to bring Bernie Sanders I think supporters overall, to the tent? The message to young voters is that you know, we need to make sure that, 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 uh, that we defeat Donald Trump because the last thing uh, that this country needs is four more years of Donald Trump. And you're welcome. This is a big tent. You know, stay in the big tent. Don't, don't sit on the sidelines. We, we just have too much at stake. And while you might not, and, and look, any young voter, any young person, you know, has to learn, has to, has, we all have lessons that we go through in life. And everything doesn't go 100% our way. Young people don't like hearing that. No, they don't. They don't. But it's it's a, those are lessons that you learn throughout your life. Do you want to let the perfect be the enemy of the good?